the final uh, exercise we're going to have a little look at for our activation series is a squat to halo. Okay, so again, here we're kind of combining two exercises to get good bang for the buck. We're warming up the lower body, but also getting some rotational core work in as well. So for this one, we want to be holding the kettlebell upside down. Okay, this position, we're going to work with one. And all we're doing here, come down into our squat, keep the kettlebell up high, try and get as low as we can, drive up out of there, core stays tight, try and come all the way around, back the other way into our squat. Okay, so you can go fairly heavy-ish up to you over there, the limitation is more going to be on the halo. If you want to make the halo part a bit harder, you can try and go a bit wider. Okay, so if I'm here, the further away I have it, the more challenging I'm going to find it for my core. Okay, if I have it super close, it's going to be a little bit easier. If you want to work on activate, open up the glutes a bit more in there, you can come down. You might spend a little bit of time in that bottom position, using that kettlebell to keep you up. And then work into your halos. Okay, so again, some different variations for you to play around with. Um, but again, a great movement it adds in working into our squat pattern. If you want to play with tempo, you can go a bit slower on the way down, nice and quick on the way up, and then into the halos.